Orlando Tallahassee, the Battle of Florida, and Tallahassee had the advantage early. Rodney Woods gets hung up in a block, and Kelvin Kidd goes untouched to the house. Tallahassee would take the lead, 7-0, but there wouldn't be many bright spots for the Pride tonight as Orlando would slowly begin to take over. Up 14-7 now, early in the third, and West throws a pick to A.J. Lacoste, who goes back the other way into scoring position. Orlando's third quarter was outstanding. Still 14-7 a minute later, Connor Pyatt nearly sacked, avoids it, and throws off his back foot perfectly to Isaac Perez, who scores. Orlando up 21-7 at this point. Look at Pyatt again. What a move. For six. Orlando up 21-7, and this is just the kind of day it was for Tallahassee. Allen catches the ball in double coverage. Lorenzo Allen had two touchdowns on this day. Zach Parker was tremendous as well. Orlando wins 28-14. Allen. What a beat. The undefeated Maulers and the winless Sailors. How would this one go tonight? Well, the Sailors were down by 11 early, and then the passing game became a party. Sultan Muhammad from Carter Peters. It's the longest pass of the season across the league. 94 yards. It's the Sailors within four. Sailors down 11 again, but Milos Celestino. That's a mouthful. As the time expires in the first half, which again for NYC, it's just a four point game heading into the locker room, 21-17. Seven seconds into the third quarter, Rocco Marconi, an interception? Yeah, your eyes aren't deceiving you, that's his first of the season. Returned inside the Mahler 10 yard line, the Sailors would turn it into a touchdown and take the lead. 24-21, up 34-31 with 20 seconds left. Too much Freeman, good speed. It was his third touchdown of the night, sixth of the season. You just can't keep the ballers down. 38-34, 3-0, Minneapolis. Ah, uh, Dallas. Remember how good the law were in prime time last week? Well, they were flat tonight. Murdoch Mock, intercepted by Andre Khrushchev. First interception of his career for the big man. Khrushchev putting the Wolfpack in business and stopping an early Dallas drive. 10 0. Halfway through the second, David Overstreet takes over. One, two, three. Teaching kids how to count all over this great country. Are you kidding? You're not going to catch that man. 17 0. Louisville would open it up, but it would get worse for Dallas. Just a second look at it. Why not? Cosplay to Overstreet. Three minutes later. G-O-N-E. Teaching kids how to spell two. Gone. 24 nothing. It's 30 to three. Three minutes to go. Mock to Starbuck, who breaks a tackle and scores. He got plenty to celebrate. Because that was his only catch of the night. Louisville, two and one. 30 to 10. 